Welcome to Two Old Guys Talking About Stuff on Celebrating Act Two. Art, I've got some really important stuff to talk about today. Hmm. I saw, I don't know where I saw it, it was the news, obviously local news. Um, some announcement, I didn't get it all, but basically it's somebody like the Surgeon General said, loneliness is like this big social problem in the U.S., uh, for older people. Yeah, and hey, John, I I, myself, actually, uh, I saw the same thing, and I actually have uh, a copy of the CDC uh, information about it. Uh, oh, good. So good. Uh, let me just read you the first paragraph of it. It says, um, okay. loneliness and social isolation in older adults are serious public health risks affecting a significant number of people in the United States yep. and putting them at risk for dementia and other serious medical conditions. And yeah, now this isn't news. This is not news. Yeah, we've actually that. spoken about this on a, a, a blog uh, probably a year or two back. Right, right. And I think anybody who deals with seniors, or if you are a senior, you're probably aware of that issue. Um, but more importantly, it's all of a sudden, it's become national news. Mm. And I think that's good. That's good because people need to be aware of um, how easy it is to become lonely the older you get. And it doesn't have to be, you know, somebody in their 80s. It could be somebody in their 50s just got divorced or whatever it is, their family's estranged, and they they just feel alone. They have nowhere to go. They don't know what to do with themselves. So right. it's something that you and I have been preaching to the Celebrating Act Two audience, you know, people over 50, people enjoying the second half of their yeah, life. Get involved in stuff, start hobbies, new businesses. I mean, yep. we know tons of people like that. And quite frankly, we have a pretty individually wide group of, of friends and family. So we're not right. there yet. Uh, and uh, hopefully yeah. never will be. And, and look, we may never be there. Mm. But, you know, from my understanding of, of the, quote, problem of loneliness, it can it can be, it's not necessarily that you don't have people it's an interior feeling that you are alone, even if you are in the middle of a crowd, you know? Mm. So I think for our audience, for everybody that's over 50 or anybody who loves anybody over 50, it's important that if you feel alone, you reach out, make friends, volunteer, do something about it. Yeah. Don't just... Accept it. You know, by, by the way, such a, uh, um, uh, we, we don't have uh, uh, this large staff that could go out and find music and stuff. It wasn't there one of such an, uh, uh, a lonely number or there's a song it says, uh, that had what? being alone. One is the loneliest number. Yeah, yeah one is yeah. the loneliest number. I, I quite frankly, yeah. even for more people who are beginning to, to retire, who may have lost a spouse or a long term sure. relationship. They all of a sudden are alone. Maybe the kids have moved away, and right. and while they were working and everything, everything was fine. But now that they are uh, retired or moved to a new situation, they don't have that. So, uh, but there was actually you. Uh, we were talking a, a while back, just this morning actually. Uh, you were telling me about a new film which I haven't seen yet that I wish I saw. What was the name of that on Netflix? With Tom. Oh, yeah. We, we just watched it the other night. Uh, um, a Man Called Otto, Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks, yeah. Tom Hanks. Great, great film. I, I don't know if it's a brand new film, but it's on. I saw it for the first time mm. uh, just the other night. Uh, do you remember the film Ed Asner did up, the voice up, for it? It was an animated. Up. Up, yes. Yeah. A guy, a guy in, a, in, a cart, in a cartoon chair and up in balloons and. But you know, both of those films are that same theme. Actually, Otto is about suicide. That's a pretty oh, that's pretty version. that's pretty uplifting. Glad glad you're yeah. here first. <laughs> uh, yeah, but but both films are about loneliness mm -hmm. and dealing with being quote being alone or thinking you're alone. Okay. So, well, I, everybody take care of each other. Not a, yeah, right. So I mean, even if we're not alone, and you're not alone. If you know somebody who is alone, uh, right. reach out to them and just let them know that you care about them or that, you know, if they have, if they just want to talk, that you're somebody they can talk to. And by the way, uh, John, I'm going to put the link to that CDC article in uh, the description below 
so that everybody can take a look at it for themselves. Good. Where where is it going to go, Art? It's going to go in the link below uh, the YouTube. Point point in, to it. In the, point. I, I know you love oh, doing this. Point to the link. Can I do that? Because no, no, when we point to each other, we get confused. <laughs> but I, it's down there someplace. The link below. Yes. <laughs> the link. The link. The link. <laughs> Great. Anyway, thank. Uh, good. I'm glad everybody will get, be able to uh, access the article. But please, everybody, take care of each other. And if you're feeling alone, that's the worst part. You got to reach out. You got to do something about it because you're not alone. You're really not. Watch those two movies, Up and uh, A Man Called Otto. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.